What's going on, YouTube? I'm Sick Flows so back with another reaction video. Today, we are checking out Mike Shinoda's Ghost from his post traumatic album. I'm really excited to check out this song for two reasons. One, it's been a while since we checked out Mike Shinoda here on the channel. And two, a lot of people recommended this song in music videos. So, for that, I'm excited. If you guys are fans of Mike Shinoda, slap that like button just like that and subscribe and notification bells on. That way, you guys never miss an upload. Let me know your favorite song from this album down in the comments below and also let me know why now guys before we get into the reaction video i do have a 20 second clip of this banger ass song so let's go ahead and get into this today's paid promo of the day boy it was a motherfucking conduit a transfusion hard not kubrick i grew a hard richard a richard millie seems stupid i rather the a millie and not a millie rock but rock the cradle like you an infant it's apparent my infantry lacks infinity call me sex i didn't for pussy but this one believes in infidelity Make your man replay your the auxiliary. Hit the panic button. Pandemonium. You master Roshi Okai too low. It's remnant and your potential went with it. I'm the purest commodity sizzle on skillet. Comparing our skills, yours is a blemish. You don't deserve recognition. Except a face you and I'm from your phone. Alright guys. That was the pay promo of the day, man. Dope, dope ass artist, man. I'm gonna leave the link to the song down in the description, and it will also be on the pinned comment. Go show him some love. Let him know how strong the Flow Nation family is, and like that guy reminds me of a few artists like put together into a unique artist, man. So definitely dope. But let me stop talking and let's get right into this video, boy. All right, so we have Mike Shinoda, Ghost. I have the lyrics here from Genius pulled up. Let's get it. Let's see what the song is I about. Had enough hard days. It's like if I wake up and I feel good, I shouldn't feel guilty about having fun, you know? I miss how he started these music videos, like vlog styles. She said, this is not about a poltergeist, not about a phantom that glows at night. But there are things we don't know, and I don't have another choice but an open mind. Oh, yeah. and I know what they'll say. I'm trying to make sense of what no one can explain. But I've been having dreams that after I'm awake, play out in reality the very next day. So I play along. I know Ooh. my head when they say I'm wrong. But All right, really quick. It looks like, let me just rewind that too. It looks like it's going to be... A hand sock puppet? Very creative. I'm just going to say that. Very, very creative. Um, another thing that I wanted to point out is on um, verse 1, he says, She said, this is not about a poltergeist, not about a phantom that glows at night, but there are things that we don't know, and I don't have another choice but an open mind. So this is actually verified from Mike Shinoda himself on Genius. He says, I'm not a believer, nor a non-believer in the paranormal. I've heard a lot of stories, but nothing remarkable has happened to me up until this point. I had a friend who spoke to a medium, and the medium said that we're looking for an item, which was true. That medium described a, spe a specific place to find it. Go in this closet. You'll find it in this article of clothing in this position. And it was there. That gave me fucking chills, bro. That gave me chills. And I'm loving the, the vibe of this song so far. Hey, so I play along. I nod my head when they say I'm wrong. But each night falls and away I run. On the other side till the daylight comes. So I play along. I nod my head when they say I'm wrong. But each night falls and away I run. On the other side till the daylight comes. And when the lights go down. I see things I can't explain Calling out my name The lights go down, down. Holding every memory close Tonight is for our goals Hey! Goals. 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 Tonight is for our goals This is not about you Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on Great chorus, great chorus um, I, I used to love Mike for his rapping ability, right? Like the flow, his lyrics and stuff like that. But honestly, bro, I'm kind of beginning to love a little bit more of his singing. Um, he's a great singer, bro. Great, great singer. And I'm loving the vocals on this a hundred percent. Um, even he like ghost, go I can't sing like Mike, but y'all know what the fuck I'm trying to say. Man. Oh, 
Okay, really quick. So I play along, I nod my head when they say I'm wrong. All right. So this is another verified uh, comment from Mike Shinoda on Genius. He goes to say, I can't hear ghost without thinking of the video. When I made it, I wanted to have fun to show people that this post-traumatic album was going to have a lighter side. So I cut up a bunch of construction paper, made some sock puppets, and shot a puppet video in my kitchen. Um, and I made the animation myself on my iPad. Wow. So that is very, very an important thing to note about Mike, right? And one thing I love about Mike, we all know he does a lot of his productions, right? But to even go as far as doing his own animation and thinking of the ideas of the music video and creating it in his own kitchen, you guys got to understand when you're like as big as Linkin Park, most people are under a label that takes care of all that. They don't even have any, uh, like any power to construct what they want in a music video, right? It's usually like video producers and things like that. But it's so cool that Mike got so involved in this project. I'm loving this. So cool. It looks like the puppets are singing. Like, bruh, you guys don't understand. Mike made those animations, bro. Mike made these animations on his iPad. What? All right, man. That was uh, Mike Shinoda's ghost on his post-traumatic album. Um, quick, quick things I want to say about it. Uh, I see here that it was actually produced by Mike, so he did the whole entire song production from what I'm reading here. Um, another thing, too, that was really cool, it's the music video, man. The music video, I think, gave it more... Like, the song itself is amazing, but watching the music video itself made it that, more, that much more amazing for me, right? Because think about it, any other rapper slash singer that tried to do that, like in hip hop, it would go down like, oh, this is comedy, blah, blah. But Mike, everybody knowing his personality and knowing the type of person that he is, it's susceptible for Mike to do these type of videos. And not only acceptable, but actually really, really creative and really, really fun to watch. From using the socks on the music videos, and they looked like they were actually singing along. He did that perfectly. And having, like, the ghosts and things like that come out in the chorus. And the little, like, ghosts flying around and stars and things like that. The animations that he did on his iPad, bro. They were dope as fuck. So, this goes to show a lot of people, man. You do not need a label or a company or anything back in your dreams because here mike is living his dream already not only did he produce the song and most likely he wrote the song as well and not only did he produce and write the song but he also shot the music video himself in his own kitchen and did the animations himself all by himself even though he is a millionaire even though he's a big star and can pay people to come up with these ideas and can pay people to produce the songs for him and can pay people to do everything for him he did it himself and that is why i love mike shinoda man he's absolutely talented man this song right here was a 10 out of 10 i see why you guys recommended it and i'm glad i checked out the video rather than the song Video gets a 10 out of 10 for me as well. Let me know what you guys thought about this video down in the comments below. I'll leave the link to the original in the description as long with my social medias as well. And don't forget to slap that like button. And guys, don't forget, follow me on Twitch. I do live reactions on there almost every single day, man. And without further ado, guys, I'll see you guys next time with another one.